let's check your TikTok version. Now, if you're on the TikTok app and you're worried that you're not getting all of the features that are commonly available to other creators, I'm gonna show you how to get all of the latest features and make sure you have the latest version, including the beta testing version. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks guys. Now let's open up the TikTok app here and you can see which version you have by tapping on profile at the very bottom, right? Tap on those three lines at the top, right? And we'll choose settings and privacy. Now, all we need to do is scroll to the very bottom and you can see at the very bottom, the version is 35.6.0. That is the current build that I have on my TikTok account. However, you can always sign up for the beta program if you wanted to get basically the latest features associated with your app. So what we're gonna do on here is tap on terms and policies. And then at the very bottom, join TikTok testers. So tap on that. And essentially this will walk you through the process of getting beta updates to the TikTok app. This will give you the latest features available as they're kind of beta testing it before it is publicly available. So the first thing we'll do is tap on the test flight. You need to download and install test flight on your iPhone, or if you're on an Android, you'll basically download and install the beta testing app. So download and install test flight on here, and then you can go through the process of signing up for the beta testing for TikTok. Now, if you're still not getting the latest features, the next thing I recommend doing is opening up your settings here, tapping on general, and then iPhone storage. We're gonna find the TikTok app here. And you can see again, 35.6.0 is the current version, but let's hit offload and reinstall this app. This will reinstall a fresh new version of the app if there are any kind of bugs or glitches that are preventing you from getting the latest features just by reinstalling it like we did not right now. It'll keep you logged in, keep all of your data, but you can always just go back and it should be working with all of the latest features. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks guys.